Well, Kenny, how might how big a win might that turn out to be? Yeah, hopefully significant. Uh, congratulations to the players that found a way today. Um, I thought that um, you know, Burton in a fine run of form and played very well. And we didn't really get hold of the midfield until late on. Probably the substitutions, you know, when we, we put a third midfield player in there, maybe helped us and and then you know looked like you know we we were more capable of scoring than than them and, and that proved to be the case with a, you know a very very decisive winner uh, congratulations to the players though it's 83 points you know today we found a way we dug in uh, at times i thought we defended fantastically well and uh, made it hard for you know a, a, a burton side that were flowing and um, although i don't think it was one of our best performances i felt we found a way today and showed some grit and determination which you do need during the course of the season so as i say 83 points with 12 12 to play for you know we have to keep chasing those 90s is gonna you know we're gonna need that if we're gonna get second spot you went in front how disappointing was it to be pegged back right after half time now i thought that burton started you know right on the front foot though as to, you know i didn't think that um we, we 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 came you know into the into the second half right to be honest with you we didn't look like you know for the first 20 minutes of the um of the first half any uh, sorry of the second half anyway we just had enough in midfield. We just didn't, you know, we didn't have enough bodies in there. We didn't cover it. They were playing through us, you know, uh, uh, and um, they're probably, you know, four against two and made it toll really. And, and for the likes of Boyce and Aikins, you know, they're experienced players who have a lot of championship, ex you know, uh, championship games under their belt as well to be able to play off up front and a good header for Boyce. So no, I don't think that um, on the hour it was one each anyway, and I don't think we deserve to be in front necessarily. But I did think, as I said, you know, the subs just helped us. Uh, Bryn probably had three very good chances and, and you know you can do that from midfield and you know just said to him there have confidence in yourself you know you've scored you've scored already in a you know early in your career breaking from midfield and um, uh, when when you get chances like that it just shows you you will score so when you're standing there right at the end and thinking oh well a draw today you get the smash and grab what was your view of that goal yeah there's you know there's obviously I, I haven't seen it again so you know I've come straight out I don't I don't know you know was it a you know offside was it a handball or, or, or anything you know it's not it's, it's not something that uh, I've seen again to comment on but uh, I'm delighted when it you know it's popped to Matt Clark on his left foot anyway uh, and um, you know he didn't need asking twice to, to score the winner great scenes anyway behind the goals as I said for the players you know 83 points out of out 42 games is a great total however you get there and we found a, a win today and um, um, our season's still ahead of us. We have to look forward to Monday now. It was great performance from the defences, def defensively, the defenders. But also going forward, Burgess might have scored. Nathan Thompson was involved in the goal. And, of course, Matt Clark scores it. Yeah, we do feel, and particularly off the bench as well, we're always you know, likely to get goals. We feel that. You know, we do think that's the case. And um, so subs probably just... You know, give us some life when we needed it. Maybe that was the case as well. Slight tactical tweak, as 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 I say. But um, yes, we do think you know we're a you know we're a threat going forward, and um, uh, 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 today we proved that. Sometimes, like today, have you just got to stay in games and do it the hard way? Yeah, it certainly was hard, but you know you're going to to work hard for every point you get, and you know, defending is a big part of it. Um, we don't want to be. Uh, defending like that every game and, and, uh, and we're not but you know coming to Burton today with their tails up really um, and uh, you know their side fit and the amount of let's say championship uh, experienced players that they have with uh, 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 Quinn, a Aikens, Boyce you know you could see that uh, in terms of their use of the ball they were, they were very good and as I said you know as a side we worked very very hard we came through it anyway but no after an hour I didn't think we deserved to be in front although we, we'd led and um, you know from then on uh, probably then with with Ronan coming on as well, it's you know the two subs at 60, Ronan coming on at 65. You know those three subs gave us, uh, I, I think, a bit more c control and uh, an extra body in midfield. But most importantly, uh, some life on the break and uh, some chances. And the winning run goes on, which is all you can ask. It is, and you know some some pressure on the players as well with a, with a situation pressure that uh, they're thriving on at the moment and rising to, which is good to see.